Hello, I'm Dennis with HTC Vive, and today I'm going to take you through an overview of a series of powerful new software features for the Vive Focus 3, designed specifically to enhance location-based entertainment services. Let's begin. A common pain point in the location-based entertainment business with VR is implementing large-scale inside-out tracking, tracking users in VR in a big space. Most headsets in the market today can support a tracking area of up to 10 by 10 meters with lighthouses, and third-party solutions can be expensive and difficult to set up. Vive Focus 3's new LBE mode can support areas up to 1,000 meters squared. That's a play area of about four tennis courts, and the Vive Focus 3 can enable this free roaming experience in this larger space, all while maintaining six soft tracking at sub millimeter accuracy. So with the Vive Focus 3, we've dramatically improved scaling the tracked space. But what about scaling the number of users? Previously, having a three player VR experience meant having to complete room setup on at least three headsets, each requiring its own room scale setup process. The Vive Focus 3's brand new map sharing capabilities allows you to share a headset's room setup map with multiple other headsets. This means you can complete a room scale setup for multiple headsets in your deployment by just using one headset. This dramatically saves time and manpower and makes deployments simple so you can create and scale up bespoke experiences quickly and easily. We've now made it easier to unify your arena's real-world physical design with your content's virtual environmental design. You can do this easily with the Vive Focus 3 by using the brand new Aruco codes. The Vive Focus 3's Aruco code is a type of visual tracker that can provide real-world positioning information to the headset in real time. With the Ruko codes, you can align virtual scenes and assets with real-world physical environments to create a more immersive experience. Aruco codes can also be used to provide extra tracking points in the room scale tracked environment. This can enhance player safety by potentially minimizing the risk of VR position drift, reducing the chances of your players bumping into obstructions while playing. For businesses that need to massively scale up user rotation or quickly deploy in different environments, such as for certain training scenarios or VR exhibitions, the Vive Focus 3 now has Visual Odometry Mode. Visual Odometry Mode allows the Vive Focus 3 to bypass the need for environmental setup so that users can just put on the headset and immediately experience 6 off tracking. This is a much better solution than doing something like canceling the boundary settings. Visual odometry mode can provide six off tracking even faster because there's actually no map saved in the headset. No map saved doesn't mean that there are also no virtual boundaries. In visual odometry mode, you can still set up boundaries in the Vive Reality System settings. Along with visual odometry mode, we are also enabling LBE hybrid mode. In addition to good and reliable tracking performance, LBE customers also require high throughput for better ROI. To achieve this, the onboarding process for LBE is extremely important. This prep will usually happen in a dedicated area called the donning area or vesting room. With LBE hybrid mode set up, the Vive Focus 3 headset will be in visual odometry mode in the prep area so that players can orient themselves with the headset and have everything correctly set up. And when the headset moves into the designated play area, the Vive Focus 3 headset will resume into LBE mode with a previously set up large scale map. Lastly, we are happy to announce that the Vive Focus 3 is now Wi-Fi 6E certified. Operating in the 6 GHz frequency, it enables low latency and high bandwidth, all with less interference from other devices. You can also have more than double the number of devices with their own dedicated channels in any VR stream. You can enjoy Wi-Fi 6E at no added cost because Vive Focus 3 has all the hardware needed for Wi-Fi 6E support. That's a brief look at the new LBE features available for the Vive Focus 3. 
there are a lot more exciting new LBE and enterprise-oriented features coming in the future. If you're interested to learn more or want to get in touch with us to collaborate on a project, please check the description below for more information. Stay tuned to the channel as we're going to be introducing more new updates and features for the Vive Focus 3 that will make it easier to let your businesses scale up. For now, I'm Dennis, and I'll see you next time.